I work for Minio and uh, we really love Go and the community that's behind, me, uh, that's behind the project, Go project. What I'm going to talk about is uh, the thumbnail generation which uh, we are going to like, which we have done using the listen bucket notification. We have extended our uh, API. So uh, what is Minio? Uh, Minio is an open source object storage solution uh, written in Golang. It's uh, Apache V2 license. And uh, it's compatible with Amazon S3 client libraries, uh, APIs. Uh, what comprises Minio stack? Uh, Minio stack has a Minio server, Minio client, and Minio SDKs. We have SDKs in Go, Python, Java, and we are uh, working on releasing uh, the SDK for .NET. Uh, running Minio is very easy. All you have to do is to just get the binary and just run it. It's a single binary which gets you the browser and uh, the server in it. Uh, Minio also supports Lambda functions uh, with uh, targets like Elasticsearch, Redis, Postgres, NatsIO, and the rest. Now, uh, coming to event notification, what I'm going to do is I'm just going to do a demo which is going to use Minio Go client libraries, uh, Minio Go SDK listen bucket notification API. I'll just walk you through the code and then we'll just do the demo. So, I'm using the imaging library for thumbnail, uh, thumbnail generation, and I'm using Minogo client library. So in the main function, you can see like, I have just taken the authentication for my Minio server. Along with that, I have used the bucket listen bucket notification here where I have said that on bucket image, please listen. I mean, just listen to the bucket name image. I mean, I'm, I'm hoping most of you are aware with uh, Amazon S3 concept of bucket and objects. Uh, how many of you are not? Or the object storage as such. So what I'm doing here in, is I'm just listening to a particular bucket and I'm downloading the part, a particular object which is on a bucket with a JPG image, uh, JPG format, and then I'm just converting it into thumbnail using the API, uh, using the thumbnail package, imaging, and then uploading it back to a bucket name on image hyphen thumb. So I'll just show you the demo, like how it's kind of. So I have this bucket. I'm just going to upload a object which is of a type JPG. Here I'm running this code. It just shows that I'm notify hyphen thumb minio.go the code is basically notified that there is an image of type JPG that has been uploaded to a bu bucket name image and I have to just generate thumbnail for that. So there it is, it's the thumbnail that's been generated. So I'll just show you the original image and the thumbnail that's been generated. So this is the demo.jpg which I generated. This is the original image. And this is the generated thumbnail. So that's it from my side. If anyone has any question, just let me know. I'll be around. Uh, the references, so Minio Go client library I have used along with that uh, imaging library for the thumbnail generation. Uh, if you have any question, I'll be around. Uh, we are uh, websites like Minio.io. All our developer team is sitting on Slack, so we are there to help you if you have any question. And that's me. My name is Atul. Uh, Gautam has already said that, so that's it. Thank you from my side.